You'd think I don't feed my cats. This is mustard. <laughs> Scrounging around for any dropped sheep nuts. I have starving cats, obviously. Sniffing around. And then munching sheep nuts. <laughs> mustard kitty, you really are a hunting gathering. <laughs> Omnivorous cat. <laughs> Look, you totally find ones that the sheep have missed. There's Maya doing the same thing. <laughs> Saying, ooh, mustard found some. I must find some. <laughs> You're such a funny cat. You are such a funny cat. Yes. You'd think I'd starved them. Horses are all happy. Well, you will be more happy tonight. Marco Polo kept saying he wanted to come in today. Kept standing on the headland, whinnying every time he saw me. So he's the reason you're all in. Isn't that right, beautiful girl? Okay, ladies, I've raked out up the yard. Everybody's settled in for the night. It's still very light out. And I'm going to go in. How are you? You're so good. You're so good. Aren't you good? Yes. You're bold, but you're good, aren't you? Yeah, you're bold, but you're good. How are you? How are you? So, Ebony has the narrow blaze and a little bit, come here, let me show you show your face. has a bit broader blaze, but you can see how you can confuse the two. They both have very similar blazes. So when you're looking at them front on, I sometimes mix ebony and a little bit up. But then if you look at the back side, a little bit ebony has black, sorry, appropriate bobby socks and a tip to the tail. Whereas you don't, do you? No, she has no back. Her black legs are black all the way down. No white bobby socks. And a little bit of white on the tip of your tail. Hence your name, Little Bit. She just wants the uh, alfalfa. Okay, ladies, see ya. See ya tomorrow. See ya tomorrow.